Thank you for attending Wauwatosa East's 123rd Commencement Ceremony. We are on your ramp and Sophia Hefner, Senior Class Officers of the Class of 2022. We'd like to ask you to stand for the singing of our national anthem by the Tosi East Choir. We are so excited to be with you here today. As we, sure, as we are sure you've heard so, so many times, it's been a tough year. A tough couple of years, actually. We are so grateful to our administrators, teachers, and all those who have worked tirelessly to make the best of our time at Tosi East. And thank you all for being here and for your constant support throughout our endeavors. Sure, these past four years have definitely hit us with some twists and turns. We've seen you all meet these obstacles, big or small, with grace, integrity, and compassion. These challenges have created a diverse, encouraging community that neither of us could have imagined, and we feel that this needs to be celebrated. We thrive in language, entrepreneurship, and innovation. We succeed in the humanities, sciences, and everything between. We fight to protect the earth and everything and everyone in it. We create, perform, and astonish through music and theater. We express our identity, culture, and beliefs through art. We are very technologically advanced in Zoom and other Chrome applications. We are civically engaged and challenge what we believe is wrong. We are chess national champions, state basketball champions, and we destroy West in most things. <laughs> A lot of us can run really far, really fast. We have earned over $2 million in scholarships to pursue our next steps, whether through employment, the trades, or higher education. We are leaders, thinkers, helpers, learners, mentors, caregivers, builders, musicians, artists, athletes, and collaborators. On these talents and traits, we are so excited to watch you grow and expand. It will be amazing to see how you will apply these qualities to the world and your future.
We are grateful that we had the opportunity to share these past four years with you, and we are so proud of everyone. Thank you for being kind. Thank you for following your passions and dreams. Thank you for showing empathy in the face of adversity. And thank you for being part of the amazing class of 2022. In the words of Taylor Swift, I'm feeling 22. <laughs> now enjoy our graduation ceremony. Good morning. My name is Molly Cole, and I'm one of the senior class officers for the class of 2022. I have the pleasure of introducing our student speaker, Ella Kirstein. Ella has been heavily involved in her time at East High School as a member of the girls basketball team, French Honor Society, and National Honor Society. Next year, Ella plans to attend Xavier University to major in film production. Please welcome Ella. Hello and thank you to all who have come today, the teachers and faculty, the families of the graduates, and especially the graduates themselves. If you don't know me, my name is Ella Kirstein, and I'm one of the graduates here today. First and foremost, let me say a huge congratulations to the graduating class on our achievement. It is such an important step in life that we have all taken and that we've all gotten through. When I was drafting this speech a few weeks ago, it was hard to choose a focus. There are so many different topics about growing up, moving on, and leaving loved ones. So using my problem-solving skills that I've earned with my Toti's education, I googled, what does graduating high school feel like? Just to see what the answers would be. There's a lot about the future, about friendships, and a new chapter. But I think the best response was comparing graduating to the drop of a roller coaster. The weightlessness, your stomach dropping as it falls closer to the ground, and the excitement of lifting your arms in the air and screaming with joy and fear at the top of your lungs. It truly encapsulates the end of these past four years that we have been through and how much of a wonderful, sorry, and yet trying time has been. The whole experience was a roller coaster. I mean, we had to go through high school during a pandemic. Of course, during that time, we had our families and parents, but as much of they may have tried to relate, they never really could understand what we were going through. That is why it was so important that we had each other. For many, including myself, having the ability to talk to my friends and have them by my side was one of the things that helped me get through that time. The friendships that we've made along the way and the ones that we've left behind have all transformed us into the best versions of ourselves so far. And of course, there's more to come from each and every one of us. Over the past four years, I've watched and experienced new friendships and relationships blossom from a simple wave in the hallway, jumping on each other's feet at homecoming, and tightly squeezed next to each other in the student section during games. It was definitely a process to get where we are today, and it's crazy to see what we've made of ourselves and who we've grown to become. Freshman year me would not have imagined that the senior class would be this amazing group of people and as close as we are. And with these friendships come memories that we will all hold on to for the rest of our lives. And I think that is what's most important, to name a few really good ones. Winning the state basketball championship, streamers and confetti thrown into the air during the pep rally, going to Cops and Culver's after every volleyball game this year, beating West in many different sports, many different times, standing ovations and Pegasus on opening night of each theater show, the best outfits on Spirit Days, and the funniest segments on video announcements. Thank you, Miss Beeble. With such huge events like those, the smaller memories make even more of a difference. Like the question of the day for Miss Gould, countless laps around the hallway during passing time, playing Mario Kart to mark the end of the year in physics with Miss Robers, and Chef Paul's amazing food. But, as all roller coasters do, they eventually end and come to a stop as we step off. Of course, it makes me sad to think about all the memories created and the good times gone by, but it makes me even happier to remember that there are more ahead of us. We're only 17 and 18. There's a whole life to look forward to, a whole world wing for us to step foot in. I'm sad to see high school go, especially senior year, 
But what pushed us on was truly each other. The people we care about the most, the people who made us better, who made us do the best that we could do. Wherever you are headed next, the friendships, relationships, and memories that we have made these past few years will guide us into a brighter future. And remember, once a Raider, always Raider. <laughs> and now it is my distinct honor to introduce Ms. McGinnity, Interim Principal of East High School. Good morning, graduates, school board members, faculty, parents, families, and guests. At this time, I would like to take the opportunity to recognize the students of the class of 2022 for fulfilling the requirements to earn your high school diplomas. Receiving your diploma today is something to be really proud of. It is also necessary to recognize the very important people in the lives of all of our graduates families, friends, and staff. You have been a vital part of the graduation process. Your nurturing, guidance, encouragement, and love has been instrumental in the fact that we are here this morning. Thank you for your continued support of our graduates along their schooling journey. I would now like to recognize the members of the class of 2022 who have achieved the highest levels. The class of 2022 has one salutatorian and 16 valedictorians this year. At this time, I would like to invite our salutatorian and valedictorians for the class of 2022 to the stage. Olinchek. <laughs> Kaylin is our salutatorian this year. She is she was a captain of the track and cross country teams, an editor for the yearbook, and a member of National Honor Society and Spanish Honor Society. Kaylin plans to attend the University of Wisconsin Madison next fall, where she will major in biology. The remaining students are the class of 2022 valedictorians. Madeline Cicero. <laughs> Madeline has been a member of National Honor Society, Spanish Honor Society, Link Crew, Key Club, Best Buddies, Chess Club, and captain of the tennis team. Madeline plans to attend University of Wisconsin-Madison in the fall, where she will pursue a degree in neuroscience. Molly Cole. Molly served as captain for Tosa East Girls Swim and Dive and the Brookfield Glacier Girls Hockey Team and was a member of the National Honor Society, Key Club, Best Buddies, and Student Council co-president. Molly plans to attend the University of Wisconsin-Madison pursuing a degree in business. Nathan Foley. Nathan was a member of National Honor Society, Tri M Music Honor Society, Spanish Honor Society, captain of the forensics team, and a member of the Pitt Orchestra for the Spring Musical. Nathan plans to attend Northwestern University and major in civil engineering. Audrey George. Audrey is a member of National Honor Society, German Honor Society, Link Crew, Activity Director for Key Club, and the captain of the girls' soccer team. 
Audrey will be attending the University of Minnesota Twin Cities, majoring in international business and German in the honors program. Sienna Keys. Sienna has been an active member of National Honor Society and Link Crew and was a four-year member and captain of the Wauwatosa East Seniors. Sienna plans to attend the University of Wisconsin-Madison in the fall on the full ride where she will pursue a degree in psychology. Mason King. Mason has received 11 athletic varsity letters, is a four-time diving state qualifier, editor-in-chief of the yearbook, We the People teaching assistant, Spike Ball Club president, student athlete advisory council vice president, NHS member, and Tri-M member. Mason plans to attend Dartmouth College in the fall, majoring in quantitative social science and participating as a member of their dive team. Colin McKelly. Colin participated in jazz, concert, and marching band as a trumpet player and has also played on the tennis team for four years. Colin will be attending Creighton University where he will be studying biology. Molly Monternach. Molly has been involved in National Honor Society, Tri M Music Society, Spanish Honor Society, Global Scholars, and captain of the Varsity East Dance Team. Molly plans to attend Virginia Commonwealth University in the fall to pursue a degree in forensic science with a minor in chemistry and Spanish. Aiden Mathai. Aiden was a team captain for cross country and track, a member of Link Crew, DECA, National Honor Society, Spanish Honor Society, and the Students Athlete Advisory Committee. Next year, he plans to attend the University of Wisconsin La Crosse to pursue a degree in statistics with a concentration in actuarial science and run at the collegiate level. Grant Mathai. Grant has been involved in Link Crew, National Honor Society, Tri M Music Honor Society, Student Athlete Advisory Committee, DECA, Varsity Cross Country and Track. Next fall, Grant plans to attend UW La Crosse, where he will study biochemistry and continue his running career. Anya Ramft. Anya is president of Key Club, co-president of Student Council, activities director of ACLU, captain of the girls soccer team, member of the National Honor Society, German Honor Society, the Environmental Club, and Global Scholars, and has enjoyed her role as a teaching assistant for the We the People competition. She plans to attend the University of St. Andrews and study international relations and German while playing soccer at the collegiate level. Annika Schiller. Annika was active in the forensics team, German club, key club, and National Honor Society. She plans on attending St. Olaf College in the fall and major in German and English. <laughs> Kathleen Steiner. <laughs> Kathleen has been part of National Honor Society, Spanish Honor Society, Student Council, president of DECA, varsity golf team, and founder and president of Girls Who Hike. After high school, Kathleen plans to attend the University of Nevada, Las Vegas to pursue a degree in hospitality and tourism. <laughs> Lauren Hill. 
Gwendolyn Tufnell. Gwendolyn has been a part of the Tosi East Players, Chamber Orchestra, Fiddle Club, and Tri-M Music Honor Society. After high school, she plans to attend the University of Wisconsin-Madison and participate in the Global Launch London program. Ryan Westfall. Ryan was part of National Honor Society, Rock Climbing Club, and the We the People competition. Ryan plans on attending Colorado School of Mines with an undecided engineering major in the fall. Sydney Wilkins. Sydney has been a member of National Honor Society, Student Council, Tri-M Music Honor Society, Spanish Honor Society, Key Club, Link Crew, Captain of the Golf Team, On the Varsity Softball Team, and in the Red Raider Band. Sydney plans to attend the University of St. Thomas to major in actuarial science. Please help me in congratulating our salutatorian and valedictorians for the class of 2022. That's fine. There are many other members of this graduating class who have distinguished themselves both in the classroom and through service to others in clubs and organizations. You may have noticed the different tassels and cords being worn with the traditional red gowns. Each tassel represents different levels of academic achievement. Each of the cords is representative of an honor society or honor achieved by the students during high school. These awards are also designated in the program with specific symbols. Congratulations to all the graduates who have earned these distinctions in the classroom and throughout East High School. I would now like to welcome Dr. Demond Means, Superintendent of the Wauwatosa School District to the stage. Good morning to our families, friends, and loved ones of the graduating class of 2022. And greetings to you, graduates of 2022 of Walter East High School. I would like to congratulate you on your outstanding achievement of becoming a high school graduate. But graduations is not about you all the time. You achieved this fantastic achievement because of family. I want you to remember the first day you were dropped off at junior kindergarten or your first dance at Wauwatosa's. Regardless of where you achieved and what you achieved throughout this uh, journey, you had family who supported you. So I want you to join me in standing up right now, try to locate your family somewhere and wave to them and say thank you. Thank you, graduates. This is what makes graduation so special. It's about a number of different people. Obviously, it's about you, but it's also about the people in the stands. On behalf of our school district, I want to thank all of our families and friends and loved ones who are here today. We're not the school district that we are because of you. You help us become the very best that we are. And so on behalf of our school board, and we have school board members here today, I wanna thank you for your ongoing support of the Wauwatosa School District. Thank you very much. Graduates, 
And Ella, I'm going to use the theme of chapters. So thank you. This is the next chapter of your life. And as I mentioned earlier, the chapters of your life thus far have been co-written. There have been people who have helped you write the chapters of your life. It could be your family, teachers, coaches. But now you are truly able to write your own chapter. You've gone through a lot. You've gone through so many significant things, ranging from a global pandemic to having to struggle and go through your last semester at Walatosa East without Nick Hughes. If you forgot what he looks like, Nick Hughes, could you please stand? I would be remiss if I didn't take this time to thank Mr. Jordan Stein and Betsy McGinnity for stepping up and being the leaders of Wauwatosa East this year. Seniors, you're the best evaluators. Did they do a good job? All right. The next chapter of your life, you are the primary and lone chapter writer. You alone will make sure what the next chapter will look like. And I'm reminded of what Dr. Martin Luther King once said when he said, make a career of humanity. Commit yourself to the noble struggle for equal rights. You will make a better person of yourself, a greater nation of our country, and a finer world to live in. So as you start to write your next chapter, Commit yourself to good things. Continue to uplift others. Focus on the positive and the future. And I know that you are equipped and you are ready to do amazing things. Thank you for the contributions you've made to Wauwatosa East and our greater Wauwatosa School District community. Continue to strive upward and onward. And again, on behalf of our school district, congratulations. Thank you. Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, good morning. My name is Charlie Brzezinski, and I'm one of the senior class officers for the class of 2022. I have the honor of introducing the teachers who were chosen by the senior class to announce the members of the class of 2022, Mr. Damon White and Ms. Sarah Oliver. Mr. White and Ms. Oliver were chosen because of their close relationships and connection they have formed with the class of 2022 over the past four years. By choosing them to read our names, we honor the commitment that they've made to our class. Also with us today to hand us our diplomas are two valued members of the Wauwatosa School Board, Mrs. Sharon Muhlenfeld and Leanne Fraley. Please note, oh, Uh, please note, just as like a logistical thing, um, there will be two sides of graduates called. The valedictorians, salutatorians, and student speakers will be called first. Then students with the last names A through LA are going to be called from stage left, while students with the last names LE through Z are going to be called stage right. Please give our selected teachers and school board members a warm welcome. Charlie Brzezinski. Colin McKelly. Yeah. 
Madeline Cicero. Molly Monternock. Molly Cole. Aiden Mathai. Nathan Foley. Grant Mathai. Audrey George. Kaylin Olenchek. Sophia Hefner. Annika Schiller. Ella Kirstein. Kathleen Steiner. Sienna Keys. Gwendolyn Tufno. Mason King. Ryan Westfall. Anya Rand. Sydney Wilkin. Andrew Albinger. Lucas Lee. Joshua Anderson. Leah Leffler. Aiden Anich. Caitlin Lemke. Brian Banks. Leah Lemke. Maureen Arnold. Ebony Lewis. Noah Barrientos. Alexandra Lewis Penland. Madeline Bartz. Emily Lenahan. Madeline Bartz. Essence Lockett. Megan Bauernfein. Abigail Leffel. Dominic Beluso. Galen Lopez. Brooke Bacella. Joseph Lopez. Tasaya Bentley. Jaden Lohr. Thomas Bean. Marco Loro. Alexander Bigham. Amari Lucas. Yeah. Ella Bershbach. Natalia Lucchini. Aiden Blackman. Yeah. 
Nadia Madasian. Jake Bader. Sabia Manuel Bugembe. Leon Bond. Isabel Marjorie. Carson Boyle. Miles Mayer. Jalen J. Rari Boyle. McCarthy. Ava Brittingham. Kylie McDade. Cameron Brown. Haley Woodashek. Gunner Bush. <laughs> Allie Meisinger. Christian Camacho. Cameron Mercure. Natalie Carey. Eli Michaela. Grace Charlson. Trevon Mikulski. Molly Chartier. Brayden Miller. Theodora Chicatello. Irena Miller Latiker. Cole Collum. Harrison Mills. Elsa Comensoli. Aubrey Moore. Ella Cousins. Cousins. Michael Morian. Noah Crawley. Nyla Morrow Earl. Dane Cretton. Zaire Motley. Remington Cripe. Kevin Mulligan. Lance Shapleski. Oh. McKenna Crumple. Nora Murphy.
Madeline DePello. Tess Murra. Juan Deza Mejia. William Neva. Owen DeBoer. Shelby Nadine. Samuel Deegan. Madeline Newman. Ava Dendoven. Dawson Wynn. John Dewey. AJ Nichols. Madeline Dewey. Claire Nistler. Greta Dietzler. Joseph Nigro. Chase Dispinet. Liam Omernick. Maxwell Doddridge. Elliot Oquist. Alyssa Dominguez. Ingalise Ornberg. Neve Donovan. Gavin Austin. Stuart Dobrowski. Elizabeth Owley. Archie Dowell. Aiden Paul. Ricky Dreska. John Patterson. Isabella Druick. Lydia Perez. Gabriella Duarte. Joey Peterson. Charles Angling. Jonah Patch. Gavin Esch. Keon Pettigrew. Alex Esser. Grace Pionek. Or Nora Pionek, sorry. Ethan Esser. Chloe Podlipski. Nadia Yule. Reese Fister. Kelsey Evanson. Lauren Prantel. Aaron Fecker. Charles Randall. Ava Ferguson. Claire Ramp. Stacy Fitzsimmons. Carlos Real. 
Kate Foley. Aaliyah Reed Hammond. Aiden Forston. Antonio Rio Frio. John Fody. Elvis Ritteris. Julia French. Ariana Roberson. Taylor Frick. Percy Robertson. Mira Gajria. Donovan Romulus. Isaac Ganger. Terrence Roundtree. Benito Garza. Aiden Rothi. Jelani Camacho. Sophia Saceda. Owen Gendrich. Oh, Olivia Scallon. Oh, Isaiah Gengembri. Brian Schmidt. Dale Gurla. Andrew Schultz. Stuart Goldsmith. Evelyn Schumann. Samuel Goodwin. Kerrigan Seagren. Olivia Gore. Tomac Sender. Jackson Gottfried. Woo! Natalie Shea Pfeiffer. Woo! Samuel Gottfried. Woo! Wesley Schumann. Aiden Gould. Shea Seidner. Venice Graham. Chase Simmons. Benjamin Granger. Kwame Sinat. Quincy Grant Jr. Joseph Cirola. Samuel Gunlock. Cooper Scar. Gabriel Hack. Isabella Slaybach. Mackenzie Har. Sean Slater. Gabrielle Hadhager. Lamar Smith. <laughs> Colleen Hackett. 
Logan Smith. Carl Hagen. Ella Stanley. Denrick Hansen. Azalea Stokel Roberts. Andrew Hansen. Kylie Thompson. -it. Thomas Harper. Santana Spate. Casey Harrison. Kidron Staples. Ethan Hero. Grace Bay Dennis. Joseph Hine. Steve Steven. Azalea Henriksen. Oliver Stokel. Nate Hoist. Molly Stubiak. Kennedy Hill. Daniel Sun. Lauren Hill. Elliot Tate. Ryder Hill Vastro. Nora Tate. Jalen Hines. Samuel Terrence. Calvin Hurt. Quinn Taylor. <laughs> Sawyer Hollander. Xavier Teague. <laughs> Diana Holmes. Luke Thomas. <laughs> Cecilia Janish. Harley Thompson. <laughs> Mohammed Jihad. Parker Thompson. Jaden Johnnies. Gina Trampy. Jenna Johnson. Annika Belay. Justine Joman. Aiden Bondre. 
Aiden Jones. Stella Vermeulen. Ladarius Jones. James Vining. Timothy Jones, Jr. Abigail Ballin. Alex Joseph. Haley Walker. <laughs> Anastasia Kohelski. Donovan Washington. <laughs> Madeline Puchelski. Samantha Wellicky. Connor Kelnhofer. Arthur Wellenstein. Evan Kerstein. <laughs> Joseph Westfall. <laughs> Lillian Kessler. <laughs> Molly Wickensburg. <laughs> Molly Kluth. Luke Wilfer. Caitlin Cosea. Emma William. John Cock. Tyron William. Meadow Cook. David Wilson. Micah Korb. Giovanni Wilson. Jessica Cutleric. Jacob Wodeshek. Andrew Krause. Mason Wood. Marie Krause. Ryan Wood. Walden Kugel. Lauren Wonderlick. Anna LaGrange. Ava Wydurka. Jack Lampasona. Henry Wysong Grass. Jenna Larson. Adriana Zhang. Tyler Lavora. Jack Zoutner. Brandon Zavaleta. Jackson Zellermeyer. Jaden Zerk. Asaminia Zwart. Yes, Mina.
of 2022. As the newest graduates of Wauwatosa East, and in keeping with the tradition of our graduation ceremony, you may now move your tassel from right to left. It is my honor to present to you the members of the Wauwatosa East graduating class of 2022. I would now like to welcome Mr. Hughes to join me for our remarks. I still have chills about that backflip. He stuck that landing. Woo. So before we begin, I really want to thank the principal at West High School for allowing us to be here today. Very nice of him to do that. I hear he's a really nice guy. <laughs> Graduation day, June, June 11, 2022. It's been circled on the calendar for a long time. It's been the day we celebrate the end of a successful journey to a Tosa East graduation. Nelson Mandela once said, it always seems impossible until it is done. And in March of 2020, when the world got turned upside down, things did seem pretty impossible. You were sophomores, thinking about whatever sophomores think about, and looking around and hoping to become juniors. Suddenly masks, quarantines, Zooms, cohorts, social distancing, and vaccination status became something we had to consider for nearly the next 24 months. Everyone feared getting the close contact email and required quarantine getting sent home randomly at some hour of the night. Some of our friends and classmates enrolled at a new school, something called TOSA Connected or WVA, while others of us tried to figure out what was cohort A and what was cohort B. Gradually, we worked our way back to a semi-normal existence in this last year. But we could spend the next hour talking about our COVID journey, but I'm going to leave that for you and your 20-year reunion in 2042. Oh, right? Woo! They come quickly. They do. One of the things that the class of 2022 certainly understands is the unpredictable pace in which life can change. Literally, a blink of the eye, and we go from attending school and enjoying a Chef Paul lunch. I mean, let's be honest, that guy can make anything out of leftover chicken. Seriously. And the right amount of water, it's like a delicacy. To cherishing your Chromebook, Chromebook charger, and finding out that Zoom is a great way to stay connected to our friends, families, and peers. But the unpredictable change is not just limited to students. We are all susceptible to the opportunities that life unexpectedly can present. My moment was this January when I transitioned to West to be that interim principal, leaving my team, my staff, my students and my school community was so hard because I adore East High School. But leaving East under the leadership of Betsy McGinnity, the first female principal in Tosa East history, the first, is a prime example of how unpredictable change can create amazing outcomes. The thing about life is that you cannot always control what happens, but you can control how you respond. Your class responded to this wild journey by building friendships, helping each other out, and demonstrating flexibility and resilience. Taking over leadership from the iconic and sometimes funny Mr. Hughes has been no easy feat, but your class in particular has made this journey a welcoming and supportive one. Even on the toughest days, I could always rely on you all to cheer up the halls with a smile and a friendly, hey, Miss McGinnity. We knew your class was special. When Charlie was in charge of getting mulch for the Unity Garden last year, which meant he got 15 cubic yards of mulch dumped in his parents' driveway 
for reference, that is a lot of mulch. So he needed to call in reinforcements to move the mulch from his house to the courtyard at East. He got on the loudspeaker at the end of the day to ask for help and your class showed up with minivans, wheelbarrows, and buckets. Several of you pitched in to help spread the mulch in the Unity Garden and open up a parking spot in Charlie's driveway. This is just one example of how you all have supported one another throughout your high school experience. You even embraced a skeleton as an honorary senior member of fan sections at games. Woo! Let's go! Woo! Sorry, a little much. Per usual. I recently described your class as one of the kindest that I've had the pleasure of working with. You may never fully understand the impact your kind demeanor has had on our school community during a tenure that has been full of challenges, but I assure you, it has left a lasting impact at East. We know that you have gained valuable skills and knowledge that you will take with you on the next step of your journey. Journalist David Brooks said, almost every successful person begins with two beliefs. The future can be better than the present, and I have the power to make it so. Class of 2022, we are here to tell you that with you all going off into the world, we know the future will be better than the present. And that you all will leverage your power to make it so. Congratulations. Congratulations. Class of 2022. Woo! As a reminder, families can return to East to take photos on the school grounds. There will be a backdrop set up by the main entrance. Now, school board members, families, friends, and staff members, will you please rise and help me congratulate our newest group of Wabalatosa East High School alumni, the class of 2022. Graduates, and the count of three, you may throw your caps in the air. Three, two, one, congratulations. Thank <laughs> you. 